Five o'clock, it's a potential breakthrough that could help get Dallas out of a very expensive crisis. Today, the city's pension board voted to explore a long term fix for the police and fire pension fund while rejecting the mayor's plan. Our Jack Fink live in Dallas with a reaction from a firefighter who is depending on that pension money. Well, Kaylee and Doug, the police and fire pension board supports a plan by a state lawmaker instead of the mayor because it doesn't require retirees to give back money they already received. And this proposal also requires the city to give millions of dollars more each year to the pension fund. All we're asking is for a fair pension now. Jeff Patterson says that's not too much to ask after fighting fires in Dallas for eight years. Nearly three years ago, he was injured battling this house fire and had to spend six weeks in a medically induced coma after receiving third degree burns on 40% of his body. I gave my pound of flesh. Those five officers who were, who were murdered in July, they gave their pound of flesh. All in favor. Patterson says he's encouraged after the Police and Fire Pension Board voted to explore a plan proposed by Republican State Representative Dan Flynn to save the pension fund, which may run out of money in 10 years without changes. It would raise the retirement age from either 51 or 55 to 58 and would require the city contribute an extra $22 million each year into the fund. Having some sort of movement is a positive thing. The pension board decided against using the plan proposed by Mayor Mike Rawlings, which would have called for higher contributions and steeper benefits cuts. The taxpayers need to be represented in this because it's going to hurt library hours and streets and, and, uh, and, and the staff at City Hall. Flynn's plan isn't fully funded in 30 years, but the pension board chair says it still would save the fund. A huge leap from where we are right now, so we're happy with that. We want to know that the city has our back. Patterson, the pension board, and others also want uh, uh, Chairman Flynn's proposal for the retirement age to be lowered to 55, among other things. And the mayor says he's not happy that uh, Representative Flynn's plan doesn't really talk about a back pay lawsuit by police and firefighters, which the mayor says could bankrupt the city if the city loses in court. And so the talks are set to continue as early as tomorrow. Live in Dallas, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.